Good morning guys. My voice is so much better today. Welcome back to another vlog. If you don't know what's going on, I've lost my voice recently. I've been super ill, coughing, tonsillitis. It's not COVID, I've had multiple tests. I am going to clinic for the first time since Thursday and I'm quite nervous. The plan today is go clinic and then go to the library straight away until eight. Put my laptop and everything in here. So even if I get like the day book tasks done, we're pretty happy. Hi guys, it's still Tuesday, so I have been all right-ish vlogger today. Currently on my way to the gym, but I'm going to eat my pre-gym snack really quickly because I'm hungry. It's literally six o'clock and I got back around half five, quarter to six. So I've just like kind of freshened up and got changed. And now I'm going to the gym. I'm not going to lie, I'm very, very scared to go back to the gym. Like, I didn't go all of August. I've been twice since I've been back. The first time I went, did not do anything. Just walked on the treadmill. Wasn't feeling it. The second time I went, did a little bit of legs, but not really. Kind of just looked around and fucked about. And then sprained my ankle. No, I sprained my wrist. This one. So I haven't been back since. If you're not from the UK, there's, there's chaos surrounding diesel and petrol at the moment. Oh my god, that girl just gave me the dirtiest look. And I'm on 40 miles. I could walk to the gym and save the petrol. But I've had a long day. And the weather's shit. And my voice is still not fully back. So, we're just gonna drive. And hopefully fill up the petrol on the way back. Because we just went the other day. Apparently it wasn't too bad. I'm in clinic today. I have the strangest day. But not strange. Kind of normal. But still strange. I got my patient in. I literally thought I was going to do some scaling. Supervisor was like, why don't you just do the restoration instead? And I was mentally not prepared for it. And she was like, just do it. You have time. So I did a restoration. But it was just meant to be flicking the old comp out. Removing a little bit of secondary caries and filling it back in. But the comp just wouldn't come out. So I literally had to draw away everything. And then the caries were so deep compared to what you can see on the x-ray. To the point where my supervisor thought there was going to be pulp exposure. So he just stood by me just in case of pulp exposure. Thankfully did not go near the pulp. Well, it went close to the pulp. There was no pulp exposure. Overall, it was a good appointment. But I was just mentally not prepared for it. Because I haven't been back to clinic in a couple of days. And that was also my first restoration since, like, June. Ah, anyway, bye. Thank you for listening. Hello everyone, 8.12. I've just sat on my table to do some day book. No, I have not showered yet. Do you know why? Because once I shower, I want to lay on my bed. Once I lay on my bed, there's no chance to watch a candle is getting up and doing some work. So, came back at quarter to eight, gave myself half an hour-ish to kind of eat dinner, chill out. Now I'm going to do some work until at least 9.30. Um, just want to get some of the day book stuff done and then we'll see where the night takes us. Boy, you know I like it when you touch me And when we hug I feel it through my whole body The way that you stare it seems so unfair that you're flirting It's half nine. I guess what I've done, to be fair, I've done quite a lot of work. I've done the referral letter, I've done this and I've done this, which means I've finished 1.2 in an hour and a half. I've nearly done 1.4 as well, um, which is the behavioural technique for paediatric dentistry. But I think I'm going to stop there. It's exactly half nine. But now I promised Amrita, my friend, FaceTime her and go through charting with her. She's doing her dental nursing degree at the moment, but she doesn't, she can't get her head around charting and different types of charting. So I'm just going to FaceTime her and then have a little quick tutor session with her. She's ready for the lesson. I'm so stressed. <laughs> <coughs> Can you hear the boys screaming downstairs? Hi guys. You might fly out of there. <coughs> I'll try and drive really slowly so you don't fall out. <laughs> Can you even see my face? I can't see anything. It's so bright. But it's quarter to five and I got back at 4.30 and I have an appointment at the gym at five. So here we are, I'm going to the gym once again. I haven't had a break. <coughs> and I should have probably given myself a break, but knowing me, and I know me, trust me, once I take a break, that is it, I do not get up and do things. So from now on, 
gym studying clinic it's all gonna happen in one ah, see i did tell you that i am in quite a lot of pain for my legs and bum workout yesterday so hopefully today is just a quick one ah all right bye i was so wrong i was so so wrong you know how i said i was only gonna be like half an hour ish not gonna be too long the instructor hang on the guy wants me to leave because he wants a parking spot basically basically the instructor said well i haven't done a pt session in a while would you like a pt sesh and i was like today and he was like yeah right now and i was like for free he was like yeah completely free and i was like oh go on then boy was that a mistake i mean not a mistake mistake it was like a blessing in disguise but oh my god did he make me work shit me he was like all right, let's have a PT session. What are you gonna do? And I was like, well, I did legs yesterday and bum. So my body is like in pain. And he was like, oh, let's do some, um, let's do some shoulders and chest then. And I was like, okay. Boy, I've never hated it so much, but never loved it so much either. I didn't realize how much work you had to do to work your bloody shoulders out. I normally just did a couple of bench presses and called it a day. No, no, no. Forget the Smith machine. We're not using the Smith machine anymore. Oh, she got Mackie D's. Should I get a Mackie D's? Can't possibly get a Mackie D's after a really good gym sesh. But is that when you get Mackie D's? No, let's go eat some chicken and rice. Chicken and rice and some beans and some sweet corn. Colourful. Anyway, yeah, that is, this is me losing my mind. It is currently half. Siri, where are you? Siri says it's half six. So I've been at the gym for one and a half hours. Honestly, I'm in so much pain. I was already dying and he was like, you know, do some squats. And I was like, not really. He goes, well, I want to see you do squats. I mean, not like a creep, like to look at my form. Um, I did some squats. I was in a lot of pain. Bitch, why are you giving me a look? I'm going to go in now and then I'm going to make dinner and eat dinner and take a shower. And then aim is to start studying at seven, but depends how long it takes for me to make food. Okay, bye. Hey guys, welcome to Cooking with Watcha. <laughs> I'm kidding. Just making some din dins. I'm going to make some Thai green chicken stuff. <laughs> seven fifteen. I'm to leave in five minutes and I'm running late. To be fair, I was making lunch, that's why I was running late instead of making it last night. Like I should have. Your girl left until this morning. I think I'm just doing full period treatment today, like super and sub. And then next time I think they have a couple of restorations that I can do. Come on, stick, stick, stick. Good. I'm actually blind. I can't see. My lens aren't settling. Alexa, what's the time? The time is 7.17 a.m. Right, three minutes until I leave. Let's go. Hi guys, welcome back to my life. It is a Thursday, nearly seven o'clock, and ooh, I had a really good day at the clinic today. I did a lot of work. Um, I got excellence and everything. When I say I've got excellence and everything, I don't mean like, oh yay, like teacher said, well done. Like no, like excellence is like a grading system, so you get unsat, sat, or excellent. But I'm currently on my way to Linda's to do some work because I was gonna go library with Nicole and it was raining and then I saw my bed and then lied on my bed and mistakes were made. And then I was very, 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 very close to ordering a Mackie D's and I had to tear myself away from my bed and go downstairs and cook some food. I, oh no, it's not focusing. Hi guys, look, we're all studying these bitches. <laughs> Sachi. Bye bye. It is Friday and it is currently 6.15 p.m. I had a good day at clinic today. We did a good restoration. The supervisors were happier than I was with the restoration. I just thought I could do better, but we're not always gonna be the best at everything and I have to understand that and I have to accept. My hair is actually a state and a half, I'm not gonna lie. I'm just about to head out to dinner. Hi guys, once again, did not end the vlog, did not, do you know what, I didn't even finish the sentence. Future Watcher, I'm about to upload the video in a couple hours, 
but I thought I'd just say thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, subscribe. And that is my last September vlog. Was that September or October? Anyway, I'm still trying to catch up with all the filming and not posting that I did start of the year. If I do upload today, this is gonna be the first week since year three has started that I've uploaded twice in a row. Two weeks without missing a weekend. But give everything a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next week, hopefully. Bye.